So if you want to be a biostatistician, um, you really need a graduate degree. So all biostatisticians in pharma, in, in industry, are um, either master's or PhD students. And those are master's or PhD students in statistics, uh, bioinformatics, biostatistics. There's a range of, of, of fields. And it's changing every day also because, uh, because of this big data um, deluge of, you know, all this data that's coming into the, into the, into the world. Um, but some sort of graduate degree t is, is required. And in order to, before you do the graduate degree, also it's important to do um, a bachelor's degree in some kind of quantitative um, major. So like math or statistics or engineering, something where you have a good foundation with math. Um, and then also doing learning computer programming because there's a lot of computer programming involved. And then um, finally, I'd, I'd say to be successful as a biostatistician, you should uh, work on communication skills. So, you know, join your local speech and debate, you know, high school speech and debate club or something like that. I did that. I did speech and debate. And I think it's just really important to hone your communication skills because uh, all of these jobs today are all team oriented jobs and communicating and influencing people, and that's a very important piece. I, I know a lot of statisticians who are really good at what they do, and they're really good technically, but they don't have that communication piece to take it to the next level.